Welcome back team. You're gaming with the Colonel and this is Strategic Command WW2 World at War. It's my continuing multiplayer game against Pavia from Spain where he is the Axis and I am the Allies. Uh, let's see what he did to us today. <clears throat> Looks like he's uh, wintering this turn other than in Sevastopol. Oh, he wants to hurt me. And he does. Thing is, I don't think he can swap guys out quick enough. Oh, maybe he can. Ooh, can he do it again? Thought for sure that would hold. The Greeks are going to be sucking. I need another turn to get him out. be able to get him out or not. Oh, he got around me. Look at that. He's going to be out of supply, though. Okay, he's landing in Guam. That's not good. So Guam's going away. Unless he has a headquarters there, I might be able to hold a little while. So he left that open. Can my headquarters get in there? Dive, dive, dive. Dive to stay alive. There you go. Dive, dive, dive. How do you see it? Uh, all this, we know where all those carriers are now. Come on, dive to stay alive. Dive to stay alive. Oh, his whole fleet's there. I'm going to lose that guy. Yeah, it looks like I'm going to lose that <clears throat> destroyer as well. Oh, he made it into port. Ah, bummer. The Australian did not survive. Thought I was being slick, but I was not. So, oh man, this is terrible. That's a strategic bomber going after an army. Here's the dive bombers. Regular bombers. Oh, that army's sucking wind. Now that's brutal. From a 10 to a 4 before anything even happened. Okay, he should be hurting. He's trying to get around the other way on that one. Oh, there's a... They're not in port. It's going to have to deal with that. All right, so we lost the destroyer. We lost the 12th garrison. We lost an army. Japanese submarine shells the California coast. I have to check on that. Paratroopers, that's where they are. Okay, it's good to know. Okay, Sydney, Australia. Going in Canberra, good to go. Battleship out here to Los Angeles. Okay, fine. We'll hold off on that. All right, let's go find out what happened to my submarine here. He is sucking wind and hiding and trying to run away. Let's get out of here. I can try to make it to port. Might be an idea. If I can get to port, I might be able to fix it. Okay, good to go. You. Well, I wish you could get up here. I really need to get to a port. You're going to hold as long as you can. If I came up here, he would smoke me. Oh. All right. 
you're holding, you need to upgrade. You need to upgrade, but you can't. But you, you can't. Not enough supply, probably. Right, so I'll have to swap those guys out. I don't know if I want to do that. This guy's definitely going to get an upgrade, or he's going to have to go away. So he took that, more or less. Let's upgrade you. Bring the fleet out. And I have two guys. This one can't really get there yet. So we're going to have to wait one turn. Did he have a submarine over here? I don't know. guy here is going to come out. I don't think he's out here, though, honestly. I don't think he's out there. You're going to get fixed, and then you're going to get upgraded. You're going to come out. So the question is, is, is he on here, or is he not? And this guy's going to come out as well, try to pick some stuff up. I'm wondering if he's got anybody there. <clears throat> One way to find out would be to put the carrier out there. I suppose I could wait another turn, although we know where all his carriers are, right? They're over here. These guys need to be upgraded. Can't not upgrade the carriers. Let's go see if he's got anybody there. He does not. And it's a national morale objective. All right, so let's, uh, let's pick it up. And start working our way forward. You're going to get Guam, but that's okay. We held Midway and Wake. And we're going to start getting these back. in here, nothing. All right, so let's take a look at research real quick. We can do some research. Uh, we're really hoping we get uh, this naval weaponry up and running. We're going to have to upgrade a lot of stuff. Don't really care about this. Don't really care about that, although maybe I do. Uh, I do want the last shit in logistics. Take care of that. Now let's go purchase a bunch of special forces. Don't think they need mobility. So I'll be able to buy one of these. Wow, that's it? Just one? Okay, it leaves me with 140. For a maritime bomber, would not suck here. What's in production? 
That's going to be going over to Europe. Now let's see what else i got to do. I know I need to move MacArthur. The maritime bombers would not suck at this point. MacArthur can't reinforce. Don't know why. He's not on a port. That's a problem. Let's get you on a port. <clears throat> okay, that, that ain't it. That's still not a port, is it? It's got to be there. Supply here is good. You can swap out and still upgrade next turn. I think I'll be using my money for other things, so that's okay. So you move here, you move there, you move here. I got 194 for the Brits. Advanced Fighters is in. That's maxed, that's maxed. I can go one more here, and then that'll be maxed. I also get the second shit in anti-submarine, which I really kind of need, so let's get that. All right. Now, let's go deal with the... Before we continue on any, anywhere else, I want to deal with those subs. Where's those subs at? There's one over here. Let's see, this one here, is he even there? He is not. And I can see the rest of this. So he went back up north. There's one. He's locked in. Okay, so he's locked in here. can move one out and that's it but he's locked in there he is come on dive there you go get off my line get off my line You need to kill him. All right, Infinite Slinky, do the job. Outstanding. Well done. Get some national morale. Head back home. Get some supply. You did your job. Now, looks like we have some out this way as well. Check this line up to here. Nothing else there. Oh, I should have checked up to there. I hope he's not right there. Now I've got to go check it. Darn it all. No, he's not there. Okay. So the line is now secure. We need to get uh, back to 10. You're going to get in here for a supply of 12 and be moving out next turn. What does this cost to reinforce? 7, 128. Well, we know where the money's going, but that's definitely happening for the U.S. Okay, so these guys are mostly clear. 
I'm going to need to bring him over. Now let's check out what's happening over here. Greece is not looking good. He can get to the port. Why don't I, if I swap you out, what do you have anyway? You've got uh, four action points. If I do this, can I still get to the port? Can't do that. Why not? Can't swap you? He can swap. He cannot. Okay. So he needs to get to the port. I don't know. If Greece surrenders, does this guy go away? Can I disband him? No. move him, which might be the way to go. What happened here? I get land back? Did he retreat? Looks like there's a... Uh, Where's my, there it is. Looks like I can't bomb that, but I can bomb him. 20% shot, or I can just let him regain his morale. So do I spend 44 getting him out? And does he go away? Does he go away? I don't know. I wish somebody could tell me the answer to that. So he costs 44 to transport. So if I transport him, that's all my money. Let's think about that. Over here. Let's blow this guy away. Finish him off. Now let's get you on the coast. Let's move you down here. I kind of want to upgrade these guys. You need to reinforce first. You need to reinforce, and then we're going to upgrade. Oh, we can only do one point? Why is that? Oh, no money. That was a waste. I shouldn't have done that. These guys are not going to make it. So let's get you down and get you around. you as fast as I can over in this direction, get you up into India and get you fixed up and prepared for the fight against the Japanese because that's coming. here. I guess we're going to move forward. Bring you here. Bring you to El Alamein. are all 
British units, I think. You're going to go to here. You're going to fly to Cairo. You're going to move forward. All right, that's all good. He's under the weather. Both of them are. They can't do anything. I think we'll keep one carrier in the area. Although the fleet's going to have to leave here fairly soon. You went around. That's not really a good choice for you. Because you're out of supply. Your supply is now zero. You can make it back to the capital if you need to. going to go up here, smack down on him, move you out to the middle of nowhere. One, two, three. What's his movement? His action points are two. Your action points are three. One, two, three. I'm going to move you to here. One, two, three. You can't reach. You can't reach. Got to get him away from this guy. I'll bring you right here. Okay, you can just go ahead and do nothing. You're going to go ahead and keep this guy's entrenchment down to zero. Your morale is really blows chunks. We'll hit you just to get experience. No, that didn't work out well, but say la vie. They're definitely going to be going down. Got a couple of points. I might as well. Well, hold on. I might not do that. This guy can't disband him. This guy can't disband him. Okay. He's going to get some morale off of that one, but what are you going to do? I just didn't have the money this time. I don't know what I spent the money on. Over here, we have lots of, uh, what did, where did he go with the other guys? That's what I want to know. Okay, we killed the one up here. So let's, let's take a look at the reports here. Um, losses, detailed losses, Germany, submarines. He's only lost one. There's a lot more out there. Okay. Let's go this way. I have a feeling he's going to...
I got to cover. I have to cover this lane because you might be in here. And uh, you either go up here and deal with this. I know there was more up here than just the one, so I can send you up that way. Or I can send you to deal with a bigger possible threat of, uh, I don't know, up here is kind of important. Don't find any more. And it could be coming out of here as well. Plus, I don't know where these guys went. I think what I'll do is I'll send one to the south. See if I find them. Nope. So I'll send the other guys north. There was one in here. I just don't know where he's at. <clears throat> uh, where do I send this guy? Put you up here for now. All right, so then let's let's talk Soviets. You are sucking wind, and you're about to go down. So I think it's time to get you out of there. You've got three action points, so. Let's swap you. Let's swap you again to get you out of out of there. May not last, but get these guys out of there in case he takes it. Okay, stand by. I'll be right back. Something's binging downstairs. All right, we're back. The casserole was done. All right, so he's working on that. He is mission complete. So, that's good. Now, this guy can't do any damage to him. That's unfortunate. That's four. I don't want to do that. So not a lot happened over here, which is good, I suppose. Let's see what we got here. You are covering him. Okay, Zukov is over here with a rating of nine, so that's excellent. So let's uh, let's get rid of this guy, detach him, and we will attach him. I don't think we need any of the air right now. Should we get the armor? Okay, this guy's a scout, so he can look. He can look see. What are his properties? He's a light tank. He has a land spotting of two. If I move him up here, he can still move back, and I can see what this guy is, if he's weak or not. So, should we do that? But the problem is, is if I move him up, he can only go back one. <clears throat> Let's see here, what do I want to build the next fort? Okay, these guys are also a problem. <clears throat> OK, 
that can hurt him, which would be good. Ten new units to add from the Soviets. Just a core. <clears throat> Okay, so you need to undo that, and you need to attach that. We need to undo this, and we need to attach that. All right, all good. Now, this guy's going to move up. And we're going to probably put the core there. Yeah, for sure. You cannot upgrade, although I can upgrade the fortification, which I might do, because this air is down here, right? So, <laughs> over here, I think I'm going to detach him, because I think he's going to leave. See, now it's still zero, zero. Now it's zero, one. Now I think we're going to hit him. Let's hit him, and then we'll leave. Oh, I can hit him again, and then leave. Let's do that. Okay. Okay, you undo him and attach him. Now, do we get a hit? No. I want to move back and out of range. I'm going to move you up and do a hit with him. I'm going to move you back. Jeez. Two. Move back. Where's the headquarters at? Oh! Should we go looking? Should we try to surround this tank? Boy, that's... These tanks are spread out. I could try to hurt him. What would that look like if I tried to surround him? <clears throat> that would be a limited counterattack there. Oh, we found this guy. I wonder. Let's hurt him. He's probably got a submarine in here somewhere. Well, maybe not. Let's go looking. Hmm. Here's the problem. That is a problem. Ooh, he made it. I could hurt him or I could leave. Let's hurt him. Is it worth doing? Anything to make him spend his money, right? That 
wasn't worth it. <clears throat> Over here, we're good, we're locked in. This is okay. This really needs to not be an army, but it's okay for now. You go ahead and get your reinforcement, and you get your upgrade. Let's take a look at research. Uh, we could try to go get fighters. You get your reinforcement. He could jump. I could jump in behind him. I would do it right now. Let's go see what you've got. I see him, but I can't say what it is. Okay. All right, and the reason I want to move him is because I really want to build the fort here. <clears throat> Although that's behind the river. Do I need it down here? Should I, should, I, should I move him? Are you going to be able to get over there? No, let's go ahead and put it there. Let's go do this right here. It's 105 days. Uh, it seems like a lot. Let's do that. All right, let's go purchase an army. Shock army at this point. I really need another HQ. I really need another HQ right down here. And right in the center. He survived the winter, so that must have been Russian winter, and he had to fix everything, which is why he didn't attack. Go ahead and make these the second ones, which we will need in case he attacks the towns. You can go ahead and get your upgrade. Oh, I guess I'm not there yet. You get your upgrade. You get your upgrade. Let's take a look at production. What do we got coming in next in February, March? March we have, okay, we do have a headquarters coming, but no units. We're going to need some units. You go ahead and just get fixed. Well, I could hurt these guys. that line.
Corps would come out in May, Army in June, Shock Army in May. So it comes out quicker. So let's get the Shock Army. Takes a good chunk of our change. Let's do re some research as well because we're not doing any research over here. Uh, we really need advanced fighters. We're about to get anti-tank too. We really need artillery weapons. Let's get that going. And can we get... We could get rocket artillery. Heavy artillery. It'd be June. It'd be May. What we also need is anti-tank guns. Let's get that research going. All right, so we don't have any money to buy anything. That's okay. We're going to go ahead and reinforce. You. You. He's going to get pounded next turn, I'm sure of it. Gonna come down and smack him hard. You need to hold on and run the line. Who else needs an upgrade here? You already moved. Your one reinforcement. These guys are fine. Okay, so that's it for the Ruskies. Let's see if there's anything else out there that we need to move. Doesn't look like it. We still haven't upgraded these yet. That's probably a mistake. Now let's go see what's going on over here. He destroyed another army. He's working. We're not going to go back into there. That was not good. We're giving up the hex, and we need to hold two turns to get that one. This guy's definitely going to take the upgrade to air defense. We're going to purchase the new an army that got destroyed. Leaving me with not a lot. I.e., well, actually, 171's not bad. This is just chilling. That's not his main effort. I've got air defense here, but I'm going to go ahead and upgrade you anyway. Because you can. You've got some air defense. You're going to move to here. Although, what I really want to do is upgrade you first, because otherwise you're going to step into the uh, into the stuff, which is not good. So let's see what we're going to do here. Production technology, I can't go any faster. I'm still waiting for infantry too. I'd really like command and control. You're okay. You're okay. Yeah, you're okay as well. Let's get you upgraded. Well, hold on. Let's see. What does a uh, core cost? Although I really don't want cores. I want army. So I 
combine it on, 135. It'll come out without anything, but it's an ornament. It'll be like this guy, which isn't really worth sticking into the battle yet. So I think I'm going to pass getting on the army. I'll do that next time, and I'll upgrade my units because the upgrades are important. So you, Stillwell, is going to travel. Where do I need the guys most? Let's see. Let's undo him. And attach him. Have you move forward into the breach? You're getting ready to get popped. You can step forward. You can step forward. I see you. You get your upgrade. Still, will you go up north? I could swap you guys out, but you haven't attacked there yet, but you're getting ready to. Somebody's going to get thumped here with this artillery piece. I'll find out where the main effort is once I know where the second artillery piece is at. Which I currently do not know. <laughs> he doesn't look like he wants to come here. My supply here is six. It's okay. So he's getting ten, nine, eight, seven, six. That's as nanning as a zero because he's been sitting on it so long. Could move him here and bring him down one. That would probably give me better supply. And why is that just nine? It's eight. He's been bombing that. Let's upgrade the town. Upgrade the capital. I moved you to here. I'd have a lot less supply there. Nine, eight, seven. No, I wouldn't. I'd still be there. Six is okay, though. Six is all right. I'm okay with that. Not fantastic, but it's okay. Nowhere's got lower than six. Okay. Do you want to pressure him into doing something? And an entrenchment of six. This guy here. He's a special forces unit. These guys are going to be uh, in trouble here real soon. I think we're kind of done with the Chinese. Uh, slowly but surely. Upgrade these guys. We'll save the twenty nine. Gosh, can't go anywhere. The next time I'll roll on over here. I 
Bangkok is still Bangkok. It's going to double time you all the way to Mandalay. But losing that much morale is not worth it. I think I need to upgrade you now. To upgrade you. He's going to take forever to walk down here. Or, well, two turns. It's still better than shipping, I suppose. You need to get into here. You need your upgrades before you can do anything worthwhile. 61 left. Not a lot. This guy can't even reinforce him. So out of money. Ah, here's a reinforcer for seven. Good deal. All right, so that's out of money. The payday can get one, wherever that is right now. You're going to keep doing what you're doing. We've landed here, taking out the uh, Entawak. We'll be working on moving out smartly next time. Do I want to put him in the water? To get one of these. I want to get these uh, national morale objectives, start bringing his national morale down. Let's see here. Yeah, he can get there. Oh, I don't have any money to do that anyway, so forget about that. All right, so back to India. Not much going on there. We've done China. I think we've done everything. And I have no money to do anything else. You. Are waiting for upgrades before you can go, and I've got no. Mo I've got ten money left, and that's all. Same thing with them. They need upgrades, and they need to be operated. What is the situation looking like for the Americans? What do they get? The carrier in December. That's a ways away. So I've got to play defense until then because he's got a lot more fleet than I do. I've only got three carriers. I've got to merge up with the uh, other fleet before I do that. So and the best way to do that is get some planes out here on these islands so I can see what's coming. Preferably maritime bombers uh, and getting long range. So I don't know where I'm at with that. Getting ready to get the second one. Okay, so next turn... We'll pop one in there. We're going to have to upgrade our units again. And that'll all be fine. Okay. All right. Uh, we know where his carriers are because they went and smoked my, my submarine in here. So they're in here. They're coming home. Let's hit the go button. Do I really want to end the turn? No, not really, but that's where we're at. Oof, let's find out what happens. Okay, they suffer some morale hits. Good. <clears throat> we'll have to check morale next time. 
uh, UK convoys from Egypt. Really? U.S. forces close in on Japan. Really? Bolshoi Theater performs some stuff in Leningrad. And we have Long Range 2. USSR gets advanced tanks too. I'm going to become more dangerous now. Uh, we got some progress in anti-aircraft. That's excellent. And the Soviets get industry tech. Also excellent. China gets production tech 3. That's good. India gets industrial tech 2. Outstanding. We are moving right along on the science part of this thing, on the, in, on the uh, research, so that's good. Let's see here. Worth double, worth double. 122 to there. Okay, we got 900 and some. So the fact that we weren't reduced, that we took the subs off of the line, really, really helped this time. I'm excited about that. All right, you've been gaming with the Colonel. Please like, subscribe, come back early and often. For now, I am out.